Hey guys and welcome back to another video on the Road Builder YouTube channel. Today, a fan has asked me why their game is failing and I'm gonna do my best to describe and tell them what they can do to improve their game, how they could possibly get more players, and why players are just not playing. So, here we go. It's Be A Boss Tycoon by Super Duper Games and the thumbnail looks pretty high quality. So I have pretty high expectations for this tycoon. Welcome to Be A Boss Tycoon. Build your base and make money and become the next millionaire, okay? Seems pretty much like normal tycoons, I'd say. You build a base, you get money. Cool. Let's hop into the game and check it out. Oh, okay, so, uh, wow, let me, <laughs> let me start. Now, none of these videos in this series are made for me to be mean or anything like that. It's my honest opinion on why I think people aren't playing your game. First things, when I saw the thumbnail, I expected like a high quality tycoon. When you jump into the game, uh, these like real bright rainbow vibes just feel cash grabby, sort of gimmicky. And uh, like, I don't know, it just doesn't seem, it doesn't seem quality anymore. So like first impressions before I even play the game, the quality is not there anymore. Uh, based off what I was expecting from the thumbnail now. I'm gonna go over to blue. I do have a cool sword Can I fly or anything? No, <laughs> I didn't know if I could or not. So let's claim this. Let's grab our little thing right here Okay, so at least it's not a dropper tycoon, which is awesome. All right guys It's so nice to not have the dropper tycoons now. It does say collect one cash per second Do I have to click on it because I'm not getting any cash? Um. All right well, it's it's pretty simple to see why it's failing. It doesn't work. Like it just doesn't whoops. It just doesn't work. Um yeah. I guess we'll hop into the next game that people ask me why it's failing. And if it's a quick fix like this, well, it'll be easy to tell you. I'm gonna go get one kill real quick. Oh, are these like NPCs? Do you kill these guys? Alright, I killed him. Do I get money? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Guys, before we leave, if I just got some money, yeah, I just got 5k. So I can actually buy some stuff and see if I can start making money. So noob workers, um, noob workers, noob workers. Oh, wow. So I could kill one person and do so much of the tycoon. Like I like I killed one guy, but as you can see, I'm just not making money. Oh, I am now. So do you have to click on these? Is there like a click somewhere? Like, why wasn't I making money? That's what I'm confused about. Because it says one cash per second, but I just wasn't making money? Okay, but hey, if you kill people, you can make money. Way, way, way faster, by the way. So I'm going to go kill some more people. And I guess the game does sort of work. So I will, uh, I'll keep going and see if I can find something else. But, oh, I didn't get any money from that guy. Okay, there's a lot of peeps over here. One of y'all's better drop me some money. Can you only do it like once per certain amount of time? Oh no, there's some money. But it wasn't 5k. Y'all is broke. There we go, that was 5k. <laughs> so guys, the game, I feel like it would have potential as a tycoon. Since it's not like a normal drop. Holy cow. I don't have my desktop audio on, so you guys couldn't hear that. But I just got absolutely ear obliterated by like a ton of oof sounds. It's that oof bomb that guy bought. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that was horrible. Actually horrible. But uh, anyways, I think this would be a decent tycoon if the map was better. Because you just have like such high expectations before I even come into the game. And then you come in and you get this. Which is not bad for a beginner builder, but it's not great for a game that would possibly get... A lot of success so let's grab a security door some walls all this stuff we've only made six hundred dollars that we can't actually collect um yeah i guess i don't really need to play much more of this game we can clearly see why it's failing i would say upgrade upgrade your your builds all right just like upgrade the tycoon overall and then of course guys the main thing man you, you can't ask why your game's failing if you haven't tested it yourself like there's just it, if it doesn't work it doesn't work you know so I think that's all I can really say about this game. Let me go ahead and hop into the next one and uh, see if we can help more than one person in one video. All right, guys, the next game on the list is called Get Up by Green OM. Now, if you guys want to know why your game's failing or you would like me to rate your game, just link it to me on Discord and I'll add it to the list so I could just go down the list and uh, rate or tell you why I think your game's failing. But let's check this out. Welcome to Get Up. Get Up is a randomly generated tower 
and earn points. Oh, get up. <laughs> Damn dyslexia. Okay, let's let's check it out. First off, I suck at obbies, so we'll see. We'll see what's up with this thing, this game right here. Now, randomly generated games are super dope because you could play them today and come back tomorrow and it's something completely different, you know? All right, so death blocks, normal or rising lava. I'm gonna go normal. All right, so it looks like we have this little counter. That's nice. The map, uh, once again, man, you can't expect people to play a game if it isn't appealing. Like, and this is not to sound like hateful or anything uh, or any malicious intent, whatever. But, oh, you can actually jump like really high okay <laughs> but if the game is just not like if it doesn't look that great people aren't gonna feel like they need to play it or even want to play it if you look at the most popular games such as like pet simulator x which looks incredible they killed everything and there's something that i'm still working on as a developer as well you can make a game look good but not look finished if that makes sense so like Pet Sim X, just the amount of stuff like sparkles on the UI and like everything just moving things like it just is finished. It, it seems very polished. This game, well, it doesn't really look done. And I would imagine, oh, you are not supposed to go up out here. <laughs> I would imagine randomly generated uh, scripts and stuff would normally look like this. Like there's not much you can really do about it. Do I have to, where do I go? Like, is that it? Am I done? Like, and what do I get? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't really know what I get um, for being at the top. So <laughs> who knows about that? <laughs> In the uh, images, there was a button, but there's not here. I have zero points and zero wins. Maybe I have to wait until the countdown is over. But uh, yeah, I made it to the top, so I'm not too sure what to do now. I'll wait till the countdown's over. Anyways, this game... I think it's probably look it probably looks like this because it's easier to randomly generate for example like a part okay this is a part and it randomly generates in a rotation a scale whatever and it makes this but it's not aesthetically pleasing like I wouldn't come in come back to this game because it looks cool or because I'm excited to see what else it can generate because I'd imagine it just generates random studded blocks which is cool but is super 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 niche and that's why it's failing man there's just not there's not any level of I, I don't feel like it's finished i guess is what i could say now once this timer ends i'll know if the game technically works or not whether i got points uh or even my win counter goes up and this kill others is this a dev product it is that's super smart people love trolley stuff in obby games so that's a really good touch i also want to see if there's a shop, like, what do I do with my points? So, I'll be back when this timer's over. Alright, guys, with just four seconds left, we're about to see if this game actually works, whether I get points. Nobody won. What was the point? What did I do, bro? I, I got to the top of the build, and... Uh, see, there just... There, there wasn't a point. There was no button to press. There was nothing. So, alright, pretty clear. <laughs> so, at least for that map, it didn't generate the button at the top. Uh, so yeah, there is upgrades and there is cosmetics. Let's go rising lava because why not? All right. Oh, I just clicked random <laughs> upgrades jump power and walk speed. Okay. So that's cool. Are we all okay? A hundred is probably I get it. All right. A hundred is probably your starting jump. Oh, what is this? Our, our sky just went kind of rainbow. All right, but let's hop up this. Oh, that's the lava. We're in the lava? Okay, that's just... How do we see it? Like, we don't see the lava, bro. Like, that doesn't make sense. And there's not even a chance. So once you die once, you're done. Because you can't even get over to this fast enough to, uh, to, to try to keep yourself alive. So... Yeah, this game mode doesn't exactly work either. So, my final things for this game, it doesn't feel finished, and it's not aesthetically pleasing. Those are the only two things I can really think of, man. Uh, but yeah, I think that is going to wrap up today's video. If you did enjoy and you want to see more content like this, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a great day. Later.